So this triangle right here is the last cut I have to make. It's the most difficult cut I have to make, but I have to get all these edges, you know, like this. video um, on how I set this whole thing up with electricity but um, I got a comment on that video kind of explaining to me because I'm in no way an expert at electricity so the comment basically was talking about how uh, I could have problems with a short on the wall because it is metal wall um, so I actually found a shorter uh, electrical box, which is super cool. So this is for old work, and uh, it just screws in. So you cut the hole and it screws into the outside, so you get a flush set piece with the electrical box, and it's supposed to just go in perfectly. And that's like about half the size of the last one. So this should work perfectly. did our electrical system before I had cut a electrical box in half which you shouldn't do because it's dangerous um, because you could short something on the wall of the bus um, so we're using remodel boxes which are about an inch deep and they fit perfectly on our wall so you just cut the hole you stick the box in you route the wires up same as any other electrical box but if you're doing the same sort of thing that we're doing in this bus, I highly suggest it because it's way safer than what I did in the electrical video. And you can still use the electrical video I made, um, but just replace everything I did with the boxes with these uh, remodel boxes right here. Um, yeah, so Lindsay is kind of compiling all of... Uh, all of the things that we've spent for the bus and it looks like a lot um that is more receipts than i've ever seen in my life <laughs> all stacked up together yeah but we're just doing all this stuff keep you posted on that uh and we should be actually finishing off that section too we're getting everything kind of prepped um to paint the walls uh and yeah so that's what i'm doing to be 
nailing the wainscot up to the top layer here. We're not gonna be doing it on the bottom here just cause you're not gonna see that part and we want it to be structural. We don't want it to soak stuff up like wainscot kind of does. I'm gonna be wainscoting this section here on the board we cut yesterday. Yeah, so lots of wainscots going up today, getting everything prepped for paint. And this weekend, hopefully we'll start getting the layers on for the paint. So without further ado, let's get into this. Lindsay is officially a better painter than me, so she's doing the 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 last coat of paint for sure. Cause, uh, yeah, I'm not I'm not a huge fan of painting for some reason. It's not my thing. I thought it would be, but I just don't really. I don't like it too much. So Lindsay, she's just a pro, and she's doing a really good job. 